Hi everyone. Welcome to API automation testing using Karate framework. My name is Surendra Jagannatham. So in the today's session, I would like to give you a brief overview on what exactly this Karate framework is and what are we going to study as part of our training program. So this is the high level agenda for our session. So for which I just opened the Karate official website itself. So if you can see here, it's an open source tool combined for API automation testing, performance testing, and UI automation testing. All these things in a combined single tool, we can consider it as an Karate framework. These days, majority of the organizations are using Karate as their API automation framework. And moreover, in our sessions also, we are going to focus Karate specific to our API automation testing. So immediately a quick question will rise in our mind. So we do have a N number of automation tools to support API testing. Why specific Karate? Why not any other things? See, the simple thing out over here is if you are using a BDD framework as part of your project, then Karate framework is the best suitable for your project. The reason is almost your web automation is on a BDD framework itself. If you want to build API automation testing using any similar BDD framework, then Karate is the best tool for you. Okay, so there's Karate steps. So if you clearly have a look into here, the scenario, what they have a given out in the example. So you have a given when, then, and so if you clearly observe whatever the regular cucumber syntaxes are there, we are going to use the same syntaxes itself. But the only thing out over here is we don't have a, any step definition. So in order to create a test script in Karate, you never need to write down any step definitions. Just by following the syntax, automatically you can validate the API. Yes, it's a wonderful feature in Karate. And immediately a quick question will rise in our mind. Unlike other automation tools, they support a data-driven testing and few more advanced concepts. Does this framework support it? Yes, of course. This Karate framework supports a different features like accessing the data from an explicit files or storing the information into an explicit file. Assume that we hit an API and we got a response. Using this Karate code, we can store that into a respective files like a text file notepad whichever it might be you can store it and even it has a customized reporting feature as well so moving further within this training program we are going to study how to handle the various apis like a get post put delete all these apis and a different combinations of scenarios how to add assertions to your test script how to store your result in a text file all those kinds of stuff we are going to study within this training program Okay, thank you very much guys. Thanks for registering this training program. See you again. Bye-bye.